Hi Scorpio, this is Sandy Couture and I am here doing the Astrological Tarot reading for the sign of Scorpio for the month of November 2021. Well, you know, November is all about Scorpio, although the sun is currently already in Scorpio, but there's going to be um, an interesting thing happening this coming Saturday, which is October 30th. Mars, the planet of action and... Um, movement forward, uh, government legal things. Um, it actually is about anger too. Mars is entering Scorpio. Now the thing about Scorpio itself is that Scorpio as a sign, they make good lawyers because they really want to dive deep and get to the bottom of what is going on. And um, good, bad, or ugly or beautiful, they want to know. So Mars is the planet of movement and you may find yourself, all of us are going to find ourselves um, in a space where the movement will be internal, deeply into your soul, so that you can get to the bottom of what may be holding you back from taking action to move in a different direction of your life or committing to something or whatever it is that you are having trouble and, and dragging your feet and not moving forward with. And my suggestion is take some time to listen. Listen for your gut reaction on that. You know, sometimes our brains are so busy and we think we're supposed to get messages that are perfectly clear, but that's not the truth. So the first card that I pulled for you, Scorpio, is the Seven of Swords. Now the Seven of Swords is an interesting card because swords are about mental activity, um, the mind, it's an air card. And there's two swords laying there, but he's got five in his hand. Looking back at the two swords, he's left. So where you find yourself right now is second guessing yourself. Um, do you have all the information? Are you, you know, dotting your I's and crossing your T's? Um, and it's a good time for you to take a look at that. And with Mars and Scorpio, that is exactly what will happen. Now, a surprise or challenge card, that's the next card position. And this is the uh, another sword card, the Three of Swords. And this, if it were a personal reading, it could be a breakup of a relationship. But in a general reading, I find it more likely to mean endings and then new beginnings. So maybe it's time for you to end a pattern. I'm not sure how it's going to manifest for you. End a pattern, end a relationship, end a job, but there's a new beginning happening for you. And the method for you to navigate this month is the Knight of Cups. Now, cups are about um, water, emotion, and this is a victory card. So have confidence in where you're going and how you're moving and what you want to do. Don't second guess yourself. <clears throat> and the most likely outcome card is an interesting outcome card for you. It's the Fool card. But the Fool card is actually a wonderful, wonderful card because it means move forward in faith. You have everything you need right now to do whatever it is your heart really desires, your inner true soul desires for furthering your soul growth. So step forward in faith that you already have it. Hopefully that was helpful for you Scorpios out there. In the meanwhile, have a wonderful uh, November. Happy Thanksgiving and all of that. And thank you for watching. Bye now.